One more job shouldn't have mattered. I'd killed nobles before. You could float a whaling ship on the highborn blood I've spilled. Another noble steps in to replace the last one. All equally corrupt. Why should an empress be different? But she was. I watched her bodyguard's face as they took him away. Dead eyes. I knew I'd pay for this one. Maybe I deserved to. A storm was coming that would shake apart everything I'd built. My old friend, it's been a long while, but you've got my interest again. How the years pass and the bodies fall. Did you know that there are only eight like you in the world, bearing my mark? I'm here because you're right. The Empress was different. This time, you can't just fade away into the shadows. There will be consequences. Your story is close to ending, and even you can't escape it. But what ending will you make for yourself? I'm here to give you one last gift, Dowd. It's a mystery. One that starts with a name. Delilah. For six months, the city writhed and changed. For six months, I tried to forget what I'd done to the Empress and her little girl. But there was no forgetting. I needed to find my next move. But all I had was that name. Delilah. Who was she? A threat? Or an ally? Word came from my second-in-command, Billy Lurk in a house built on secrets. Lurk was especially good at uncovering them. There was a ship called the Delilah. It hunted whales for Bundry Rothwild. A former deckhand who'd made good. Now he owned a slaughterhouse and he ran his workers like a prison gang. A ship named Delilah. It could be a coincidence, but it's not. In Dunwall, things are always tangled up like a bag of snakes.
You're here. I got bored, so I started without you. Turns out we're here on the perfect day. There's a strike at the plant, and it's no wonder. Rothwild runs this place like a prison. The stupid workers can't even get in without a time card. When the strike started, the butchers confiscated all the cards they could find. They've given the city watch free reign to use force. If you ever wondered why I wanted out of the slums, here's your answer. There'll be other ways in, I'm sure of it. You don't mind if I tag along, right? Just to keep an old man safe. One last thing. I found something for you. I know you collect these. I'll be on the route. Stop still you need me. you up too. You have to give me back my time card. I can't get back in. You had no right to take it. Try and get past me, and I'll see you swinging from a meat hook. Go home, mister. Orders are to confiscate those cards. No exceptions. I hope you die weeping. All of you. I hope the plague gets you. Attention. Under plate conditions, failure to report for work at industries deemed vital to state interests has been declared treasonous by the Lord Regent. They used to tell stories about a woman in the slums who did work like this. Granny Rags. They said she was a hundred years old. Still on break or what? But maybe. This is a reminder that collective bargaining in any industry deemed vital to the state is a capital offense. These include metallurgy, whale collection and refinement, security services, and selected legal and clerical specializations. Consult the city barrister for clarification and enforcement.
This is a public warning. Corvo Atano, the assassin of... Rothwild's got a stubborn reputation. I doubt asking nicely. It is going to work. Well, we're all ready. Yes, but I, I signed right away. Mr. Rothwild didn't even have to turn. We should start there. Your men, you'll collect your bonuses at sundown in my office. So, what do those idiots want to do? Well, they think they don't get treated fairly. Because they can get fired for refusing to do dangerous work. What? What danger? We're in the world. We're the dirty stuff right How much does he know by now? Ramsey? I know you. Dowd. You're the knife of Dunwall. Well, Dowd, what do you want with me? I'm not here for you. I'm here to learn about a ship called the Delilah. Did the Lord Regent send you? That old fool, Hiram Burroughs. I know all about the Delilah. All of it. And I can give you exactly what you want. Please do. Not so fast. I need something from you in exchange. That's what I thought. What? We're both professionals, Mr. Dowd. I was hired to get these gutless workers striking, which I did very nicely. And then destroy the slaughterhouse itself. That's where I got caught. And that's where I need your help. How? The whale oil in those tanks out there is enough to destroy this entire place. The important industrial bits, especially. Just open all the valves at once to let the oil start flowing. The pressure will go out of control and... 
Boom. What about the people inside? Growing a conscience? The factory workers are already out. My boss will hire them on, in better conditions than they'd ever see here. Not the butchers, though. They can die screaming for all I care. Don't try and con me. Wouldn't dream of it. Here's the key. Don't get caught. You take care of the slaughterhouse, and I'll tell you everything I know about the Delilah. You know... I could put you in Rothwild's interrogation chair myself. Why should I bargain with you? Because it's a long and messy solution. And I'm gambling you're not the kind of man who likes that. Make a deal with me. And I can tell you what you want, and pay you for your trouble. I'll consider it. Where do you go? Oh, he could be jumps if you come out. Right. 